Hello everyone, this is Prajot from Techno World. And this is Alan, and today we're going to be talking about the top 5 smartwatches of 2014. Let's get started. Number 5, we have the Sony Smartwatch 3. It's the first smartwatch from Sony that runs Android Wear and the 1.6 inch square display and the rubber strap make it look like a sporty watch and the watch is IP68 certified that is water resistant and dust resistant under the hood it has the same basic stuff like other new smartwatches like the Snapdragon 400 and 512 MB of RAM and 4 GB of internal storage so it deserves the number 5 spot now number four is going to be the Samsung Gear Lot. Now this watch is pretty cool. It has a 1.63 um, Super AMOLED display with the resolution of 320 by 320. Uh, its square display has a 1.2 gigahertz processor, uh, 512 megabytes of RAM, and 4 gigabytes of internal storage. Now what sets this watch differently from others is that it has that Super AMOLED display, which means you're going to get darker blacks and even like more saturated colors which is not bad at all. Everything will look really nice and bright and vivid. Um, the watch also features an accelerometer, a heart rate sensor, so you know you're gonna get the whole Samsung package with this watch. Now the only downside to this watch is probably the design which uh, offers a similar design to the other Gear smartwatches such as the Gear 1 and the Gear 2, <clears throat> but if you can live with that, it, you can also see on the bright side that it has a nice uh, aluminum finish to it. So number 3 we have the ASUS Zenwatch and it has the same specs as most other new smartwatches but it has a stylish rectangular design and a nice looking leather strap. It even has a metallic body and some ASUS specific software features. So it deserves the number 3 spot. <clears throat> now number 2 on the list is going to be the LG G Watch R. Now this watch is actually even nicer than the live because it has a 1.3 inch circular, full circular display with a resolution of 320 by 320 and it has OLED technology as well. So it's going to be like the Gear Live, just a little bit, um, not as super, but it's also going to have those rich darker blacks and those saturated uh, colors. Now what sets this watch apart from most of the others other than the 360 is that it has a full 360 uh, angle display. Basically that means that this is actually going to look more like a watch and not like a computer on your wrist. Um, it does feature IP67 certification that means you can take it underwater, swim with it and um, you can just do that. It's a little bit weatherproof. Uh, this watch overall is more for the rugged. Uh, look, it gives that rugged look because of its texture and because of the design with the bezels on the edges. So basically, that's a pretty good buy for you. Finally, number one, we have the Motorola Moto 360. It has a 1.56 inch IPS circular display. Inside, it has a four year old processor, but with new updates, there is no lag on the watch. And under the hood, it has 512 megabyte of RAM and 4 gigabyte of internal storage and it is IP67 certified which is water resistant. In the end I would say it is one of the best smartwatches of the year if style is your priority. So thanks for watching guys if you like this video do give it a thumbs up and be sure to check out Alan's channel. The link is on the screen and is in the description below.